Good day everyone, Pasay Bono here. This is the 7th game for today, November 6, 2023. And this is the game between Milwaukee Bucks and Brooklyn Nets. That'll happen at 7.30pm Eastern Time. So that's gonna be 8.30am here in Manila. I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pasay Baller. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on that bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. As we all know, we actually provide free picks right here in our YouTube channel, Pase Baller. But for those who'd want to avail our premium picks or premium uh, packages, just reach us through our Instagram, Telegram, WhatsApp, uh, Messenger, uh, the Viber account. We have a lot of accounts right there. Just check, up, just check on the descriptions of our videos and you can see the details and we will be responding as soon as we see those messages, okay? Alright, so um, the spread, by the way, that is given is minus 5.5 and that's given towards Milwaukee Bucks. On this matchup, Brooklyn Nets, they would be enjoying the home court advantage on this. Um, in terms of uh, momentum, I gotta give it to Milwaukee Bucks because uh, the Bucks, they are actually coming off a win. Uh, they are actually coming off a win, and that was against um, uh, the New York Knicks, 110-105. While the Brooklyn Nets, they are coming off a loss, a home loss at that, against uh, the amazing and sizzling Boston Celtics with a score of 124-114. Right, so again, going back, uh, Brooklyn Nets, they would be enjoying the home court advantage, but in terms of momentum, we got to give it to Milwaukee Bucks. In terms of fatigue, I don't think that should matter in here because both teams actually rested last night. All right, so let's take a look at the availability and health of both teams. Now, uh, I would still I would still want to give kudos to uh, these teams, where they're able to keep uh, their players healthy. For Milwaukee Bucks, no one is actually in the injury list, not even one. While for Brooklyn Nets, I see two players confirmed out. So those are Nick Claxton and Cam Johnson. While Lonnie Walker is actually listed as game time decision or questionable for this matchup. So obviously, Milwaukee Bucks would have the advantage in terms of health as everyone is available to play for their team. Alright, so uh, I'll make this one fast. I'll go with Milwaukee Bucks. Um, I think the only, you know, the only advantage that Brooklyn has on this matchup is that they are at home. But aside from that, you know, the Bucks, uh, they got the, they got the advantage, especially the, especially the fact that uh, the Nets are still missing Cam Johnson, you know, which, which could, which could actually give them, you know, like uh, instantly eight, ten points a game. Uh, Claxton is also, uh, is also a huge loss for them, especially. When going up against uh, a team like Milwaukee Bucks, where they got a lot of you know a lot of options inside the paint, Claxton will be badly needed right there. Just imagine if you know, just imagine without Claxton, Mil uh, Milwaukee's Giannis would just you know would just actually love to be in the paint, right? It's not like he would. It's it's not like he would be unstoppable, but you know it would be way easier for him without you know without that big guy Nick Laxton and again just like what I said uh Milwaukee Bucks they are coming off a win so they must be a bit pumped up that was against the New York Knicks and Brooklyn Nets they just lost by 10 points so I'm gonna go with Milwaukee Bucks minus 5.5 again that's Bucks minus 5.5 peace out pase love and God bless